my folks and friends here. Right, I'm just showing you a quick, 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 very quick video because in the minute I'm supposed to be going out, and I'm supposed to be going out in 10 minutes, so yeah, this is going to be a quick video. Right, let me talk about these. I'm just going to say to people, just be careful. Yeah, be careful when you buy socks online. Yeah, I typed in 100% wool socks and I got these, these came up. So I thought, all right, okay, I'll give them a go. Yeah, that that not bother me, I'll, I'll give that a go. It says there, I don't know if you can see it. It says 100% merino wool socks. 100% merino wool, natural wool. Yeah, sorry, it says 100% natural, not merino wool, it says merino wool on top. But then if you read the back, it says 45% merino wool, 45% polyester, 20% cotton, 5% acrylic, 5% spandex. I have no idea what that means. So they're not 100% wool. Yeah. They are good socks, don't get me wrong, but I'm saying to people be careful if you buy socks online because you can't find them. 100% wool socks, I cannot find. If anybody can recommend where I can get 100% wool socks, I would really 100% appreciate it because I can't find them. I've looked in places, I've looked in camping shops, and they don't even do 100% wool socks anymore. I'm not going to even, even if, even if it's like 60 40, I'll be happy with that. Not 35% wool, the rest crap. So, yeah, please be careful if you're buying socks online. Best if you type in wool socks. As I said, they are good socks, don't get me wrong, I do really like them. But I don't rec I don't not recommend these if you go out on long hikes because they're not good enough. To tell you the truth, they don't keep your feet warm. But I'm gonna leave it there guys because time I upload this. Thank you for watching. I do apologise if this was like a rap video, a rant video, but yeah. So thank you for watching. See you later, bye.